And again, we have a Cynthia, and it's McLeod. McLeod, I have to pronounce it well. Welcome. Thank you. Okay. Let's see. Why is your best friend your best friend? Because I love her. You love her. How many best friends do you have? Oh, I have so many best really? friends. Really? I have a lot of best friends. Yes? Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. All over the world. Okay. Oh, well, that's nice. It's nice. And every to me also. Okay. And when they are found, younger, then I call them my daughter. <laughs> I like that. How do you pamper yourself? Well, I really pamper myself. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Tell us. Um, <laughs> I do a lot of things uh -huh. in the morning, mm -hmm. but when I'm at home, I'm on my bed. Okay. I watch television on my bed, I read in my bed, I do a lot. I do phone calls from my bed. Okay. I think a, a bed is a great, a great, <laughs> uh, great function. <laughs> I love my bed, I love, yeah. I pamper myself. I okay. eat in bed. I drink in bed. Really? Do you even leave the bed or not? <laughs> <laughs> okay, you love your bed. That's kind my of. My daughter funny. always says that to me. You can have a house with just one room, the bed and the bed. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's a good question. What is your favorite book? Oh. Mm hmm. What is my favorite? Or one of your favorites. Probably you have one more than one. One of my favorite books. When I was younger, mm -hmm. I would say Mio, my Mio from Astrid Lindgren. Okay, oh, okay. Really? Yeah. Why? Because it's about a little boy mm -hmm. who is an orphan and lives with a foster mother. Mm -hmm. And yeah. He is longing for attention so much, mm -hmm. and sometimes he can go home with his friend. Mm -hmm. And the father is very nice mm -hmm. towards him. Okay. And then he's dreaming, dreaming mm -hmm. that he is a prince, and he's chosen to free his country from a very bad uh, man, mm -hmm. a very bad man who was doing all kinds of very Bad cruel things, things okay. bad things against okay. children, mm -hmm. and the whole country is counting on him that mm -hmm. he, the prince Mio, mm -hmm. he will perform well and he will do it. Okay. And he did okay. in, in his dreams, of yes. course. Huh? Yeah. And uh, I love the book. I love. Okay. It. And but why do you love it? What, what yeah, touched you then? That because that? you could see a child, a child who, who yeah, wants to be loved and. Mm -hmm. And, and how in his dreams mm -hmm. he becomes a hero uh -huh. and um, yeah you like it. and another another favorite book mm -hmm. is mm, the children's caravan the children's about a bunch of uh, yeah. a, a, a family mm -hmm. who was going in the time of the when the in the United States was mm -hmm. in the let's say 19th century, mm -hmm. when a lot of people were uh, migrating to the yes. United States and it was the thing to go west. Yes. And so the family started to leave with, uh, what do we call it, um, uh, yes. uh, to go mm -hmm. to the west mm -hmm. and then the father and the mother died. Oh. And then the six children, well, six. whereof one is a baby, Ooh. And the oldest one is 14. They wow. manage wow. to okay. travel yeah. and, and survive and over, the oh, wow. over the Rocky Mountains. Over the Rocky Mountains. And how these 14 yeah. and 12 year old children yeah. take the responsibility right. to take care of the little ones. Yeah. And, so. and it really happened. Huh? Oh, really? It's not just a story. story. It oh, really okay. happened. Okay. And who yeah. wrote that book? Uh, Anne Rutgers van der Loef. Okay. I'm okay. going to look it up. <laughs> Have you done anything lately worth remembering? Hmm. <laughs> worth remembering by whom? Or for yourself. For myself? Yes. Oh, a lot of things which I do I want to remember. Okay. And I do remember. And you do? Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> what are you doing to pursue your dreams right now? Oh, look. I'm an old woman, huh? You're not old. <laughs> You're matured, that's what yeah, you're matured. Yeah, but um, you still have dreams. dreams. What right? dreams do I 
have. I don't know. Well, everything. I am a person. If I have set my goal to do this and this, mm -hmm. I'll do it. Okay. Nothing will stop me. Okay. And I did a lot of things, yes. a lot of big things. Okay. Okay. So I, there's nothing left then? No. Um, really? Yeah. Well, not for now. I want to Stay live there. a happy, <laughs> quiet life. Uh -huh. huh? But uh, for instance, I wanted to have a boat mm -hmm. and to educate Surinamese children okay. to get to know their country. Yeah. Nice. And I did. Okay. okay. I did. Yeah. I took so more than accomplished. And in total, more than I think more than five thousand, seventy-five thousand Surinamese children wow. on an educational trip oh, really? during fifteen years. Nice. With my boat. So. Okay. I did it. This was a dream. That was a big dream. And I and I you accomplished it. Okay. <laughs> okay. Wow. And uh, what do you love to do? But do I love to do reading, writing, mm -hmm. uh, talk with friends, mm -hmm. gossiping? <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> what does the world need? What does the world need? I think the world needs many, many more women in leaderships, in leading roles. Mm -hmm in government mm -hmm. and leading the country because I very often say if the world was ruled by women mm -hmm. it would be totally different. That's for sure. For sure. Yeah. And we hope better of course. Yeah. Better, better. Yeah. yeah. She would do it. I uh, uh, <clears throat> yeah. I think I yes yesterday I was telling Cynthia or maybe this even this morning mm -hmm. Very often men are so yeah, um, impressed by themselves. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Huh? yeah. <laughs> True. True. And uh, they do things very often to impress themselves yeah. and to impress and to show people. everybody look and how good I am. And not, and not because for people. And, and not because they care right. and not for the people. True. True. Okay. Yeah. And women are different in that way. Yeah. Not all. It's, but it, but I think it's really mm -hmm. by nature. Yeah, yeah. Just the more. Yeah, the more. Yeah, yeah, there. yeah. Okay, okay. What do you have that you cannot live without? Hmm. But I mean, I cannot live without. Well, I think I cannot live without reading and writing. Okay. But most important, I think, right. Writing, mm -hmm. so it doesn't matter. Now I do it on the computer, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but paper and pencil is also yes, alright. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Should you be focused on today or tomorrow? Focused on by focused. Mind. Focused on. Yeah. Should you be focused on tomorrow or today? Both. Both. Yeah. What is happening today mm -hmm. can have consequences tomorrow. That's true. That's so I have to focus on today and tomorrow, okay. and I also focus on yesterday okay. and long ago. <laughs> <laughs> the good time. That's what I do. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Last one. <laughs> Who? No. How would you describe the next five years of your life in one sentence? Ah. If that is possible. Well. If you were a Suriname, mm -hmm. I would say maybe I not gonna be say me that about. And that means <laughs> maybe I'm near my grave already. Oh really? <laughs> you think? But for the next five years, well, it should be more or less like what the past five years were. Okay. Uh, I do a lot of traveling. Mm -hmm. I go to Suriname to Holland, I do lectures, mm -hmm. I read a lot and I, I talk a lot. Mm -hmm. As long as I'm healthy, I'm yeah, true. Yeah, and my children and family mm -hmm. uh, are healthy. Yeah. It's good for me. And then it's good. <laughs> Thank you so much.